Hello everybody, this is Jekyll Gaming and today we want to have a closer look at Elias Kötz, nickname Blitz. He's one of the German operators and you all might know him as the shield operator as you can see on this picture. Yeah, let's have a closer look at his biography. As always, you can pause the video here and read the full biography and well let's have a look at his statistic he's pretty heavy armored with his shield and his body armor and therefore he has a very slow speed his shield is called G52 tactical shield and it's equipped with a flash uh, that can um, if you trigger it in in front of an enemy temporarily blind him and then you can take him out so that's the special ability of blitz and yeah i think a short look at his loadout makes sense primary weapon is his shield you can flash your enemy or take him out with the shield as melee attack the secondary weapon is the P12 handgun with a .45 caliber. It makes a damage of 48. It has a mobility of 50 and a capacity of 15 shots per mag. Um, and then you have a recoil pattern like this. You can equip the P12 with a uh, suppressor or with a laser beam. I only take the laser beam because of the hip fire accuracy. If you don't attach it well it's it's no big deal the laser beam so you might have to decide whether you want to hide your position then I recommend you to unattach the laser beam if you um, want to have slightly more hip fire accuracy you should attach it the same thing with the suppressor it lowers your damage to 40 from 48 to 40 and um, you have to decide whether you want to hide your position but in the most times when you play a shield operator um, the enemy will exactly know where you are because you are the first who enters a room so um, I think it makes no real sense to attach a suppressor here then you can decide between a smoke grenade or a breach charge. I have attached a breach charge because I want to open my own way towards the objective. Um, but if you have a good team and if you communicate a lot with your team, um, they can breach the walls for you and you can uh, take the smoke grenade in order to irritate your enemies and to hide your entry to the towards the objective so a smoke grenade can be pretty useful that is a short introduction to blitz and i think we have to talk about his role in the team and therefore we uh, have some footage in-game footage playing blitz the first gameplay demonstrates you the tactical role you have to play with Blitz. You're a moving shield, so give your team the advantage of your special ability. You're the first one who enters a room and you shouldn't fear incoming bullets. Take position, give your teammates information about the enemies and then stay there and give them cover for incoming bullets. They can shoot at the enemies, you don't have to. Just stay there. Don't take down the shield for aiming. It's very hard for your enemies to hit you. And if you take down the shield, they might aim for your head. Use your flashlight to blind the enemy and irritate them. And if you do so, you have a short time to take out the guy. Experienced enemies shoot for your feet, so crouching could be a good idea. On this way, your teammate can take position behind you and under your cover, he can eliminate the enemy.
as you can see here we have five enemies and they are all shooting at us but my teammate takes place behind me and so we can slowly take out one by one you can peek around corners and then take out the enemy well that's a possibility you can do take some additional armor plates but um, that isn't the best choice then we stopped with our tactics and as you can see they suddenly shoot us so it would be better to stay in position and give your teammate cover so that was the fault this round and that's why we lost this round but how can you take out a shield when you're a defending operator? There are three ways to do this. If you want to shoot at him, you might aim for his limbs. So the feet and the shoulder are slightly exposed so you may hit them. The second way is a melee attack. You can take a shield operator out by two hits with the melee. The first one puts away his shield, the second one kills the operator. And the third way is the most depressing way. If you can throw a nitro cell, you can take out the shield operator and that's very, very annoying. So what should we remember when we are playing Blitz? First of all, we are the first person in the room. We enter the room and then we take position and give our teammates information about the position of the enemy. The second thing is don't fear incoming bullets. Stay there, stay undercover and wait for the right moment to put down your shield and aim for your enemy. The third one is give your mates cover. Crouch and stay there so they take position behind you and shoot for the enemy. Flash your enemy and then shoot. If they don't see you, they don't... don't aim for your head so you're in a better position to shoot at your enemies. And the last one, care of nitro cells, booby traps and melee attacks. It's very annoying to get killed by these three things. I hope these few things might help you playing with Blitz. Just try it and stay tuned for the other operator videos and I hope you have a nice day. See you soon, your checker.